During the month-long challenge at United Way for Southeastern Michigan, the Challenge Detroit Fellows split up into seven different groups to tackle the problem of food access with a focus on job creation for the structurally unemployed. At the end of the month, the different groups presented their solutions to a panel of influential people in the Detroit food space. Detroit has about half a million people who struggle to have access to healthy food. So today I want to introduce you to my friend, Harold. Harold is a real person that we... Imagine this. More than 770,000 people face hunger in southeastern Michigan. I think the projects today that, that I have heard are innovative, they're creative, and one of the things that we're always looking up to do is how can we do things differently? We know that there are always going to be fewer resources out there, so we need to look, look at what are those ideas that we can lift up and really focus in on that are different than the, the current things that are, that are happening out in the community and take those projects and see you know, what elements can we implement. I feel really good about how this challenge turned out. Even though there was a competitive nature in it, we really weren't like that and we all worked together. The next step really is for our staff here at United Way to take the ideas that Challenge Detroit generated and really give them some thought and say, okay, we have all of these in front of us. What are really feasible, maybe now or what's feasible 10 years from now? What do we really want to prioritize and what can we do with these? I think what I've learned about United Way that has surprised me is they are a very integrated nonprofit. They do a lot for the community and the people that work here are awesome and great to work with. I would just say thank you to Challenge Detroit and I really can't emphasize how much how great it is for me. I love being around people who are very innovative, creative thinking types. It really, it not only gives me ideas, but it really gives me a lot of energy to do what I do because I love my job and it's good every once in a while to get an influx of, of new energy and excitement.